from Tampa Bay Streaming News Leader, this is ABC Action News. And hello everyone, I'm Paul Legrone. Jason Adams has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment, but first here are your ABC Action News Now headlines. Local deputies tonight are hoping surveillance video here will help them catch the teenagers who vandalized the local church caught on camera. The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office believes these young men broke into St. Stephen's Catholic Church earlier this month. The boys allegedly caused about $400 in damage to a couple of bathrooms. A teenager is arrested while trying to make YouTube videos. We are not naming him or showing his face because he is underage, but here is video of deputies arresting him and then charging him with trespassing. Pasco County deputies tell us he was going to different homes and then recording videos on how to cover up home surveillance cameras. They say his plan was eventually to post the how to videos on YouTube. Police arresting a man for beating up an Uber driver in St. Petersburg. Denzel Johnson accused of using a water bottle, a car antenna and a cane belonging to a man on the street to attack the Uber driver, leaving him with deep bruises and cuts. The Uber driver was able to pick Johnson out of a lineup days later. Now here's Jason Adams with Florida's most accurate forecast. We are expecting to see a few more scattered showers and thunderstorms here on Saturday. However, the rain threats not as widespread as it has been over the last couple of days. And actually, it's going to start feeling a bit more like June out there when we talk about the rain because it's been soaking rains over the last week or so. I only have the rain chance at around 50%. I say only because the last several days it's been as high as 80%. So still looking at a few afternoon and evening storms out there, but many of you will stay dry not only for Saturday, but also for Father's Day Sunday. Jason, thank you. And don't forget, you can get all your news updates all day long on your favorite streaming device. And remember to download our free ABC Action News app.